Hey people, welcome back to another video. What are we doing today? Uh, wait, first we need to intro you. Who are you? Mr. Booth. This is Mr. Booth. Um, what's your occupation? I'm a teacher. No, what do you teach? Art. Both have our degrees. You have a degree in? Fine art. I have a degree in baking. I know it's controversial. People in the comments love to get kick up a stink about that. So I've been sent so many times for catch your art. I've heard someone wants to call it focaccia. No, that's wrong. We'll roll with focaccia. I thought it'd be fun to do it against dad because we I could bake the focaccia and Her then degree. we can yeah, and then we can decorate art style. My degree the top of it and then see whose comes out better because how funny if my decoration is better but the taste is rank how funny if mine tastes <laughs> better and i win the art as well Go so we found a recipe online um, and we're going to make thank it thank you Sally's bacon yeah. and we're going to do it step by step with each other i don't i don't know whether i want to like say things to you or not okay whisk half of the water two teaspoons of sugar two teaspoons of yeast cover and allow to rest for five minutes warm water two cups is that it warm yeah, you can get the thermometer out if you want. Spot on! If you run it from the top, it's spot on. I shouldn't um, talk to the contestants. It's like on Bake Off. You know when they help one another? It's like, is that actually allowed or is that not allowed? And so how do I do this? Off to a cracking start. Dad doesn't know how to use the scales. I almost don't want to tell you because you're not going to tell me how to help with the art, are you? I can't not tell you. I go along and then... That's 480? No. Half of like, the water, 240. I really want to just do it and together. And you said it's the same. Pants. Which one's the teaspoon, the little one, babe? Is it? Is it Grace? Yes. Yeast. You might need it. Yeast. Yeast. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not good. Look, look at the flipping state of that packet. You just... How do you pour that? See, I'm... this is how you do it properly. Do I look bothered? I've done it in the time, hon. You got to do it properly. I did do it properly. I didn't get any dirt anywhere. Pour. I think this video is going to take a little bit longer than I anticipated. <laughs> this is painful! I just wanted to do it for you! No. But you'll never learn if you never do it yourself. Exactly. Yeah. Whisk the sugar and yeast. Whisk half of the water, teaspoon sugar and teaspoon together in the bowl of your stand mixed mixer, fitted with a dough book. Oh, well, I didn't do it because I'm well, a I am. <laughs> I'm whisking! See, let's, let's, let's get to the air bubbles because you need air. And then beat on low speed. Well, we have one KitchenAid, so it would be unfair to not. So I'm just going to do it with my fingers because otherwise it would be a really unfair experiment. And we want to experiment to be fair. Competitions to be fair. They need the same variables and one thing to change. And the one thing that we're changing are the contestants. It's on low speed for two minutes. So I'm just going to beat it with my hands, bring it together. Why is that not going to zero? Or do you I do it zero it. without it? No, no, it? pop it on. Things and they've got all the ads in it. So Sally's baking addiction, get rid of the ads. It's a bit of a workout, Dad. Good job I've got these kachow muscles. Big booms. Big boobs. No, it's booms, I said. I'm going to need to add a flour. Is this the cup? No, no, you just weigh that. Half a cup. It literally says 440 four, no. four grams. Oh, I, can do I wish that. I hadn't said that because it actually said three and a half, three and a half cups. But it says 440. Yeah, no, but you were going to do a half cup. And half cups, yeah. Oh, th uh, three yeah, and a half. Yeah, oh, oh okay. you would have loved that. Hey, Alexa, two minute timer. Look at this dough hook movement. See this lovely dog movement. Two minutes and old Alexa. The dough should feel a little soft but shouldn't stick to your hands. Oh, actually mine doesn't. Sticky situation. Look, it's coming off my hands. Babes, that's stickier than mine. No, it's just if it comes off. If the dough is still sticking to the side of the bowl, add half. You're just whipping like a pancake batter. Right, try and knead that then, yeah? Are you sure you weighed yours right? Yeah. How much water did you add? The rest. Maybe I didn't actually, maybe... You didn't weigh the water. Do you know what I mean? If I, I think I put in all of it and I don't think I... Because you then could... Yeah, I don't think I did actually. How Add the remaining money, water. Though? Boom. You're going to have to add so much more flour. Really? Have you seen it? I said it's like a... I'm annoyed. That's 
it's your fault because you were talking to me. You went on bed and I had to concentrate. I'm annoyed already because I think I'm already losing. <laughs> you are, buddy. <coughs> to be fair though, a high hydration means that it's nice and light and airy. It's just harder to deal with as a Joe. Alexa hasn't said stop yet. But I started way before that, didn't I? You did. I'm not happy. Alexa, stop. Right, that's me done. Now I oil the bowl and leave it to prove for two to three hours. I'm annoyed. Tell us more. Why are you annoyed? Because I put too much water in and I like winning and I feel like I'm already on a losing streak. How do you feel that I'm done? You need to start before me and you do have a degree in baking, so really you should be able to do this with your eyes folded. I have my eyes blindfolded. Alexa, four minute timer. How are you finding that, Dad? Sticky. You're finding it easy? If you use the scraper... No, I don't want it. You heard it here first, folks. Right, I'm gonna turn the camera off because otherwise we'll be here for four minutes and Dad just doing that. Hey, what's going on here? Scraping. Yeah, do you wanna eat your words? Yeah, I'm gonna need to listen to my daughter. Mm-hmm, what did I say? younger years. Yeah, that's what I thought. This last bit of needing technique on. Dad's is really coming on. Oh yeah, he, he's needing. It's my clay days. I don't, okay. What do you mean? Come on. Focaccia is supposed to be sticky. She said sticky. And it's there's sticky. not one ounce of that that is sticky. It's gentle. It's like a little baby. <gasps> We've just been out and we just got home and they've been it's been three hours. And I have a feeling dad's it's done like <gasps> oh my, my days. days. This is mine. Wow. Um and we're just gonna put it, you put it in an oiled tin for another hour, but that's gonna be really boring. So we're just gonna do that. A slight issue with trays. Um, they aren't big enough. And we've kind of, Dad's been very kind and let me have this one. This is my beauty before proving. Dad's still caressing his. He's really working it. He's, oh, those. Okay, stretch and flatten. Okay. Focaccia is ready. Look at that bad boy. Whoa. When I tell you I have replayed that segment so many times, I'm not exaggerating. I don't know why, it just really tickled me. I'm gonna put it in one more time, just for you to really enjoy. Whoa! What? <laughs> nearly dropped the whole thing. No, you did I did, nearly slid out. Oh, mine looks good, doesn't it? Mine looks really good. No, mine is really no, good. Mine looks really good. Yeah, well, you, I did give you the higher size so you could have. No, yours hasn't even risen. What approach are you taking? I'm just freestyling it. So I am copying. Now, it... I'm not. I'm freestyling. So just remember that. Oh, I'll also say... Go on. I tried to guess. We don't know what each other's doing. And well, I you tried just saw my phone, What? No. Okay. I tried to guess what Grace is doing. And I said all along, I think it's the Five Sunflowers by Van Gogh. And she needs to say what she thinks I'm doing. Okay, I think you're going to do... B! Oh! A... A wildflower meadow. Incorrect. So look, I'm going to be using the green peppercorns to kind of add a seed-like quality. Dad, come on. You've got to narrate what, you, what you're doing. Sunset! Yeah. Hopefully I have a little bit of Earth. dappled um, sea. That's both. That's going to be tricky. Because sea is not... Sea is blue. And um, under the sea, under the sea. In an octopus's garden. Darling, it's better. Kind of concentrating. If we had a CBB show. Well, we haven't. You yeah. might have. No, but if we did, yeah. you'd have to narrate it. Yeah. Grack and But Dad. it's a bit easier. Why is that easier? Because we had a secrecy thing about this. Now you've said you're concentrating, so that's why you're not talking. Right, so now I'm just trying to get the rings <laughs> and the radiuses of the sunburst of the sunset. I'm trying to get it, and I've just about my knife, see? But it's not a pocket knife that you can fold. Thing is, I don't know what green peppercorns taste like, and I'm worried they're going to taste disgusting. Should I try one? Have you ever tried a green peppercorn? They're quite nice. In brine? They're nice. Yes. At five day. Yeah, they're hot. It's pepper, honey. Pepper. <laughs> See, I was going to go... I'm, I actually started like this. Look at that bad boy. <gasps> Whoa! Like a radius of the sun. And actually, I'm wondering, I should have gone horizon, half of it going out. Darling, it's better down where it's wetter. Take it from me. I think I should start again. Should we give a time limit on this? No. I think we should give a time no. limit. No. I... Just because I'm starting again, that's not up there. Well, it's a very bold move, Dad. But I suppose art is all about taking risks, isn't it? Yeah. And I haven't. 
but I really admire your risk because it might not pay off. Yeah, it might not, but I don't know. I'm having fun. Yeah, sometimes you just have to break the rules. Otherwise, they break you. <laughs> do, do. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Getting that little reflection happening. Put the ripples on the water. Getting a bit bigger as they come to the front because we get the foreground. Things are bigger in the foreground. Get that sense of depth. We're upside down. Yeah, my camera's broken. Come on, Sony. Sponsor this girl. Stop saying it's Canon. Come on, Canon, sponsor this girl. She needs a new camera. She's doing you some business. To be honest, I'll take Sony. They just launched their new blogger camera. <laughs> I'm not far off done, you know that. Me either. I need to brush it with some olive oil. You know, one time I ate a whole battle plant as a bet. <laughs> you did. That was with olive, wasn't it? Yeah. Right, I'm going to oil mine. This looks so much better than mine. Comparison is the thief of all joy. Oh, actually, we have to do that at the same time because we have to poke it down at the same time. Do Are you done? I just want to say a public apology to Dad for not taking a picture of his. I didn't know he wanted me to take a picture of his. I thought he'd take his own picture, but later on it unfolds that he wanted me to take a before pic, and I didn't. So sorry. And I brush it. I'm gonna go first. Put salt on it though, Anna. How much? <gasps> Gosh, How much? not like that. Just literally like a finger. Cool. Oh my word, Dad. I thought it needs a bit. I put it in, yeah? I I'm doing a dimple. What's and then mean? we have. You don't have to, but. Oh no. Get it in. <laughs> Who, what's your favourite? You have you seen them? I haven't seen them yet. Oh! Which one is which? No, they'll who's guess it? whose is whose. Right, so this is one of the focaccias. Can you say that again? I reckon. Well. That's a booth. It looks, it looks, <laughs> I say, it, the reason it looks like a booth is because it's like a piece of art, isn't it? And that one is oh, said actually. that way. Oh, I thought you meant they're both booths. I thought you meant they're both booths. But uh, appearance visually, wise. Visually, it's my favourite yeah, booth. Yeah, it's coming off. It is mine! Is yes! Oh, wow. He did the sunset, yeah. I did the flower. That was much better before it went in. I'm about to have the focaccia with tea. So here's what we have. We have got my one right here. She's. I'm actually really happy. And then we have Dad's not very happy because the sunset burn and I didn't take a picture of the before, but hopefully the video clips showed it. So the colours, he got a little bit burnt, but it's okay. So I'm gonna cut into them, but he's out for a run right now. So I'm gonna cut in and see the internal structure and then we can try them together and find out the best one. Bubbly, bubbly, bubbly. Okay, it is for Caccia taste test time. Should we try yours first? I did have a little go, but right, cheers. Cheers. Mm, I like nice the salt. Flavor. That is a good flavour. Salt's good. Yeah, nice and salty. Oh, that's good flavour. Mmm, quite nice actually. You're surprised. That's yeah. good. Light, squidgy. I think yours is moister. <laughs> Do you think that's because it's got more veggies in? It's because Dad added about. Don't you think? Yours is moister. But your flavour is better. So combine them. Oh, I just had a green peppercorn and that was not nice. Oh, oh, where are they, Grace? The green peppercorns? No fridge. Oh, I might have a couple then. So. Overall, I'm the winner. Overall, they said I was a winner in design. Yeah. Yeah. But I have to say, I would have said that when it's burnt. There's no excuses here. That's not an excuse, it's a reality. The audacity of none of my family members telling me I had a fat wedge for catcher in my tooth. I think your flavour's better, my texture's better. Would you agree? Mm. So high five together, we draw! Well actually I technically win because I got the design too. But, poppage, mine's out my little novel. That is true. Oh, so many elements. This is like so hard marking exams, isn't it? So, thanks so much for watching. Thank you so much for watching. What do we say every time? Peace out, punks. And... Don't forget to subscribe. Perfect!